<laughs> okay, so we have Miss Nancy Richard here, and Nancy came into our office uh, about four, about four five months, months, actually five months ago, mm -hmm. and um, Nancy was really concerned about the fact that she had some autoimmune thyroid related problems, a lot of fatigue, a lot of gut issues, um, brain fog, brain fog, <laughs> exactly, um, sluggishness type of feeling. Mm -hmm. Um, pain as well, so some joint pain, discomfort, um, and she had had a history of being out of the country, traveling out of the country in the military, and um, had been in, you know, to different parts of the world, and had been under a lot of pressure and stresses, mm -hmm. and so um, you started in our office, and what kind of, explain some of the symptoms that you had, Nancy. <laughs> Tired all the time. Um, Stomach hurt, um, fatigued, and um, high stress, high stress level, and hormonal ups and downs. Yeah. So that was the beginning of the craziness. And you had really sought other doctors. You had gone to mainstream doctors. You had gone to holistic doctors. Yes, and, I had. And what did you find from that experience? Like pretty much go more medication, higher the level of the thyroid medicine, and then possible blood sugar issues, so maybe towards diabetic and, and mm. more pills. Right, so definitely kind of, basically you were treated as, you know, you have a symptom, he has a medication, Correct. this is how we resolve it. If that doesn't resolve it, let's remove the thyroid, basically. Yes. So what we found with Nancy in our office is that she had a significant amount of adrenal stress. Um, actually on our test, we found that her cortisol load was 200, which is extremely high. Uh, normal is between 22 and 46. So we started to see, you know, part of the reason why she wasn't able to sleep at night and had a lot of anxiety and stress, and that absolutely had a major effect on her thyroid gland. Um, and also her hormones, we found her hormones were oh, very oh high, <laughs> absolutely. So testosterone, progesterone, estrogen were all elevated. We also found that Nancy had um, multiple food sensitivities. Yes. And uh, we began, you know, to really take her off the foods that she was sensitive to. And um, how was that? How, how did you feel through that process? It helped a lot. It helped a lot. I think the major thing was the food and um, supplements. Did you like? Did you like taking the supplements or no change? problem? No, yeah. good. Not good. good at all. And also, um, we found actually about four different gut infections on on Nancy's mm -hmm. um, stool test which generally um, most doctors often miss that because they usually just do blood tests. And this is actually like a DNA stool test to determine if it's got infections. And so we were able to see that there were four infections that were really taxing her immune mm -hmm. system. And we began to treat those with, with supplements and nutrition and you started to see some positive effects. A lot of positive effects with the nutrition, the supplements and um and actually the rice machine. Was yeah, there. absolutely. So we started to use, um, along with the supplements, a rife machine, which basically is a, a light, it's basically light generated program that will actually attack the certain infection or gut infection and kill it off basically. So we started to see through that, that your symptoms really started to dissipate as far as the bloating and swelling and pain that you had there. Yes. That's great. Um, what other changes did you see over time? Well, now it's four four months later. It's I can sleep. The energy's back. Um, everything seems to have leveled off. The gut, no more bloating. Um, no more feeling uncomfortable, and just my brain is functioning again. That's great. <laughs> totally. That's, that's great. And we also did some clay packs. We did some mm -hmm. detoxification therapies A too. Lot. <laughs> yeah, which definitely with people that are autoimmune. You know, they generally, they can't detoxify real well, mm -hmm. so the clay can actually help pull out toxins, and it's just a really good way to help you kind of feel better and have more energy and, and function better. I think it helps. So. That and the foot detox. Good. Excellent. So anything else you want to share, Nancy? Incredible. Um, still, It's still a journey. I still have a little ways to go, but I'm halfway there and very pleased. Very good. Pleased. I thought I was dying. <laughs> <laughs> And so you have an appointment with your endocrinologist next week? Yes. So we're definitely looking forward to seeing See the positive results. results on the blood as well. And um, we're just happy that Nancy's doing better and she's able to 
live a happy and, and a healthy life. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you.